Yes, so my people, good news, oh, good news, oh, good news, my people. All right, Pastor Van Van Vama spoke, man. It is a very good news for Bia France right now, as we'll be bringing you this video shortly. All right, this is IPOB Media. Welcome, 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 very well. Welcome. In case you are new to this channel, this is IPOB Media, the place where we bring you the gospel of Biafra. Yes, this is the only channel where you get the latest legit news, information, updates, trends, events, happenings, and everything you need to know about Biafra and our struggle for freedom. All right, we encourage you to subscribe to this channel, please. Click on the notification bell so you don't get to miss out on any of our uploads and uh, don't forget to share on all your social media platforms so that dear friends we get to know what is going on even the world at large and uh, share your thoughts in the comment section let us know what you think about this video also give this video a thumbs up all right my people pastor vam 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 has come out to you know talk about the plans of the Biafra Republic government in exile to set up referendum. Yes, so <laughs> we will not be waiting for you and again, we will set it ourselves. And uh, the plans they have, right, for uh, Biafrans in the southeast, I'm happy that they are, you know, doing everything possible best to take control of our resources. I wanted to hear from him as he speaks. This is the season that many of us have always looked up to. And you have always believed that one day, you know, Biafra land will belong to us. We will decide what happens in Biafra land. This is a season when we set the pace. We decide what happens in our space. That's the season that we are in right now. Honestly. In Biafra land as we speak, if we don't say it, it doesn't happen. We decide what happens in our land. And then we are getting close to that self-referendum season. Like our Prime Minister explained. Oh, goodness me, Ototoma. Wow. <laughs> Coco Mama. Wow. Longest time, my precious one. Longest time, I know you are doing well. Ututoma, Yagajeregi, Yagajeregi, Amechi Jonas, Ututoma, Chine Doom, Ututoma. Right now in Biafra land, we are telling them how we want our land to be. The oil companies, all the political office holders, we've already placed them aside. Then the oil companies, we have told them what we want and how our land must be. And they must not use us to play ping pong anymore. Not anymore. Disaster is not permitted in our land anymore. You can't cause mayhem and blame it on our people. It will never happen. Thank you, Ututuoma, Victor, aka, thank you, Koko Mama Niger. Longest time. Coco Mama, we need to talk. Maybe after this program, I'll give you a call immediately. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. I'm happy to see you. Love you loads. They do. Ada Biafra. Love you. Love you loads. Chinenye MC, thank you so much. Chukwo Kikabiyama has brought us this far. And he did not bring us this far to leave us on, on the crossroad. Every one of us must reach the finish line. And that finish line is Biafra. Like some people are asking, how will you get Biafra? How will... Our Prime Minister explained it times and times again. I will keep explaining it. Now, Biafra Republic government in exile, we bring Biafra. Certainly, certainly. Every offices are being erected. Every offices are being, you know, established right now. Every portfolio is being taken right now. The best hands are getting on the job. And uh, we are going to get to that point where we will declare our referendum and we will conduct it. We will invite the world, all the world leaders, you know, even United Nations. They are not the ones that will tell us when to do the referendum anymore. We will choose when we will have our referendum. We will decide when we will have our referendum. And we will call them to come and witness it. Akwana Biafra land. 
<laughs> the narratives are, are being changed. We are changing the narratives. We are changing the narratives. Enough of all these uh, back and forth. I don't know who. <laughs> I don't know who. 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 By yourself, eucalyptus oil, drop on your pillow, uh, your shirt because of the cold. Thank you so much. It's both a mommy. Hey, thank you so much. I appreciate you. And at twenty dollars, I guess you need me to the eucalyptus. I'm going go the original one. <laughs> original one, I can go. I got twenty dollars. What got easy? Thank you so much. I appreciate you this morning. It's both a mommy. Thank you. Appreciate you. The Lord will bless you tremendously for being a support, not only to me but to Biafra. You know, I don't know who is over seventy. Chineke mene mebere, and every fundraising she's there, every program she's there, every broadcast she's there, everything for Biafra she's there. She saw the first Biafra generation. She is seeing this particular generation. And I don't know who you will celebrate Biafra with us. I guarantee you, with my ten fingers and my ten toes, Ega for Biafra. Every one of us listening right now, you are not going to be a spectator. You are going to be a part of that history. That history that we are about to make, you will be a part of it. And those that are waiting to mock us, those that are saying, ah, they have arrested the leader. You arrested our leader. You kidnap our leader. And you called it an arrest and you thought you have ended it all now can't you see the the, the flourishing movement of the biafra restoration can't you see it can you stop it can you stop a tornado can you just stop it with a wave of your hands no way this is the hand of god at work this is the finger of god at work and god have raised for himself man your Bible, when you read it, it says that when men fail to act, that God is able of these stones to raise up seeds for Abraham. But because God took Wokikabiam and knows that there are capable hands that will bring Biafra to pass. Because Mazin Mamlikan did a very good job, a fantastic job for 13 to 15 years, always preaching. We call it University of Radio Biafra. University of Radio Biafra and why Martin Nambekan was teaching you know there are some people that don't come to class there are some people that will always go and copy notes there are some people that when they are in class their mind is somewhere else they are the type you are seeing now gallivanting and fooling themselves and becoming Nzama and hiding underground Chike, Dozie, Hachina, San Juan, Satan Emeka, Deadstone the Kalaba, uh, Bobriski of this world, the Nelly of Ebus of this world, the, 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 the Fulani boy, Kelechi of Ghana of this world, they are the fools that when Mazen Namgan is teaching, their own mindset is how they will benefit what will enter their pocket and their stomach one by one and those of us that paid attention some of us even came late to we came late to class but we sat down and we listened to our leader he taught us and we picked every word he gave us most of the time he would say come with your pen and paper hey some of us have documented series of everything he taught us our prime minister listed, he didn't join very early some of us are covid 19 M members <laughs> i don't know which of the members are you some of us are covid 19 and when we joined we paid rapt attention we paid rapt attention and we are put into practice everything we were taught and look at it our leader was kidnapped and they thought it his story would end they thought everything he has ever dreamed of we end we said no Mazin Namdekan, oh, I am happy to have you here, my beloved Helen. You know, you know, how we said Mazin Namdekan, oh, No, 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 you did not labor in vain. The oil upon your head, it must be like that on the head of Aaron. You know, that oil on the top of the head of Aaron, the Bible says it will drip. It drip from the, you know, collar. It drips down to the skirt, under, and everything will overflow everything overflow and some of us began to fetch that oil as it was dripping from the garment of Aaron from the garment of Mazen Namdekano the oil will not dry 
and that is what you see in effect right now in Biafra land. Some Okoko will wake up one morning and say, ah, I will get all the army, get all the generals and stop them. No way. Every day we wake up, every minute of our lives, we have an obligation, and that is to bring Biafra to pass. We have a responsibility, and that is to bring the kingdom of God upon the earth. Thy will be done on earth as it is done in heaven. Do you remember that Mazin Namdekanu has never one day taking glory to himself, he will tell you, it is the finger of God that will be God alone will do it. And when he does it, so that we will return all the glory to him. And now we can see everything turning around, turning around. The powerful nations of this world are lining up to support IPOB autopiloted under the Biafra Republic government in exile. They are lining up. You are going to see it. I am telling you, the news we are getting and everything, information, and they are mind-boggling. You know, if you are close to the chest of our prime minister, some of us in the cabinet, if you are close to his chest and you are close to what is happening, you know, it is mind-boggling. I tell you the truth. Believe me, dear friends. It's mind-boggling. The achievements we have made so far. The roads that have been opened unto us so far. That scripture you read that will say that a great and effectual door has been opened. The only thing is that there are adversaries. But because it is too quick, it can't be a matter. Open that gate, that door. Hey, all the adversaries will be defeated one after the other. And now, one by one, you when uh, those days when uh, Maradona of blessed memories was, you know, very, very solid, or oh, King Pele, you know, Edison Arantes Donacimento, you know him, you know, and the spectator said, Hey, a cousin. Hey, apoyo kaza. Hey, apoyo kaza. Hey, mbaha. ni hunete. You know, go keeper na abare. Apa go keeper. In the spectator sanete. Hey, apa ya na post the post shake ye. Everybody at the go. I want you to say it is a goal for you and me. It is a goal. We have not missed our target. You will not miss your target. Your target is Biafra. My target is Biafra. That is why we don't listen to gossips. That is why every morning we wake up, we wake up and we shake ourselves and we say, that is Biafra. We are heading there. As pilgrims that are on their way to the Canaan land of this present time, we wake up and we say, oh, Biafra ahead of us. Oh yeah, let's go. Kaije, 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 kaije. Where are we going? We are going to Biafra, where things are happening, where the light is shining, where there is no darkness, where there is no no danger. Weed, kaije, 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 kaije. Yes, it is a goal. It is a goal. It is, and every shot with fire is always on target. Go and look it. Go and look at it. Remember, it is, Mazi Simon, our Prime Minister said, it is five years project. Five years. Every shot that has been fired so far has always been on target. You know, there are some stupid, foolish defenders that want to defend a shot that is fired by a dragon. One <laughs> shot to walk on. Can you stop fire? A shot fired by the dragon. You want to stop it? No way. It is headed to the goal. And we must scream and shout, It is a goal! <laughs> wow. You know, you know the joy of the Lord is our strength. That is why, you know, in the face of adversity, we we'll laugh. In this face of earthquake, we smile. In the face of all these noises from the bottomless pits of hell, we laugh because our king, the Bible says he laughs at them. And if our king laughs at all this, we will laugh them. We will laugh them and we have the last laugh. 
and we must win. It is interesting that the zoo, you can see, they have already separated themselves from us already. Look at the cabinet that the ancestor, Tifnubu, the Escobar of this world, look at the, the cabinet he just selected. Did you see your people there? No! You can't see your people there because they know we are on our way out already. They know we are out of that door. We have shut the door on them. That is why they select all their cabinets. We can never be part of them. No way. We can't be there. We are Biafran. We can never be part of the zoo anymore. Count us out. We are not there. Umuchineke, remember, Ototoma is to inspire you, to encourage you, to ginger you. You know, in other words, I would say, to ginger your swagger. <laughs> You know, to ginger your swagger. So that when you wake up in the morning, then you, after you listen to Tutoma, after you hear Pastor Van Vama, you say, nah, eh, nah, you know, you know, you raise your chest. I'm going to know what will be out there. It does say, yes, I got it, man. We can't do it. Yes, we can. May God bless you this morning. As you set out to do everything you've got to do, especially for Biafra, there will be a way out. An open door and when you go for your personal activities and the things that concern you the almighty god will make sure he supports you you are not alone you are not alone he's with you he's with us and we will sing the lord's song in the law in our own land not in a strange land anymore the lord bless you the lord keep you the lord make his face to shine upon you the lord be gracious unto you and give you peace I love you, but Chukwu Kikabiyama loves you more. May God bless our leader, Mazin Namdekano. May God bless our Prime Minister, the Dragon, Mazi Simon Ekba. Prime Minister, Biafra Republic Government in exile will continue. There's no stopping us. I'll see you this afternoon. Thank you so much for joining me. Every one of you, I want to appreciate you again. I don't know. You are awesome. You're the best. May blessings of the Lord continue to rest on you and also you, beloved. Thank you, darling. God bless you. Thank you. Obi Juliana, I appreciate you. Every one of you, time will fail me to mention Uzuka Stella, you are awesome. Emmanuel Akobundo, blessings, every one of you. Thank you so much. All right, my people, you've heard from our very own brother, Pastor Vam Vam Vam. Let us know what you think in the comment section. What do you have to say regarding what he has explained to us? All right, if you're here to criticize, please do so in a respective manner, right? As this is a peaceful community. And if you've not yet subscribed to this channel, <laughs> please subscribe, right? Click on the notification bell so you don't get to miss out on any of our videos. And don't forget to share on all your social media platforms so that you know everyone especially bear france we get to know what is going on as you do that may chukokika bless you thank you